Yo, 60 days. No small feat. Thanks. Very moving share. Thank you. Can I ask you something? How'd you survive that old day? What do you mean? I mean, somebody had to save your life, right? It's my sister. <sighs> Older or younger? Younger. Um, I have to get home, like so... Like 12, 13? Yeah. She was 13. That's some heavy shit. But hey, we all do some bad shit in our lives, right? Comes with the territory. Got me thinking about what that does to a 13 year old, a 13 year old kid that finds her big sister overdosed. Bro, I know a lot of you probably hate me right now, and I get it. Love you. If I could be a different person, I promise you, I would. And why weren't you answering your phone? And why are you sneaking into the house? I was with someone. Who? It doesn't matter. It matters, who? It matters. You're doing drugs. I don't know what you want me to say. I want you to tell me where you were. I just said I was a fucking idiot. Don't be talking to me like that. You know what I'm talking about? Don't be stepping up doors around here. I don't care. You're not leaving this house until you take a drug test. I just peed. I don't want. I don't want you to fucking check whether I'm fine or I'm not fine. What difference are you going to make? You're gonna make some fun of me. You say all this, but what happens in three days when you knock on my door asking me to piss in some Tylenol bottle? What personality this I want you to 
likes to fuck little kids. If I am bipolar, I sure as shit prefer mania over depression. The other thing about depression is it kind of collapses time. Suddenly, you find your old days blending together to create one endless and suffocating life. So you find yourself trying to remember the things that made you happy. Slowly, 